you know, it's quite a technical course. Uh, when, when we first saw the design, we knew it was going to be quite a difficult course to ride and having the replica to ride every day leading into the event, uh, leading into the, to the Olympics is, you know, it's something special and I think we have a massive advantage, um, massive upper hand in, in doing this. So obviously, like, I'm super grateful to QAS, Queensland Government and, and the Gold Coast Council that we have this to, to prepare on. It's amazing and to have the opportunity to have it right here on hand before going to, away to Tokyo, um, massive advantage. I think other countries have tried um, to maybe with the facility they've already got move things around to make it quite similar but nothing to the exact like we have. Um, if we do, if they do, like that's surprising. Obviously we're, we're, we're a new sport to the Olympics and We've never had a course to ride before an event before uh, in, in, in other circumstances. So this honestly is, is the biggest, biggest uh, advantage we could get. Um, you know, usually we have two or three days to ride the course before the event. We have, you know, I've had five weeks. I'm going to have five weeks in total to, to ride this event, prepare and, and go and, you know, execute in, in Tokyo. So it's, uh, it's, a, it's a massive upper hand.